gamers. Today, we're comparing the new GeForce RTX 5070 Ti to the previous generation RTX 4080 Super. If you recall, the RTX 4080 Super and the original RTX 4080 offer nearly identical performance, with the Super getting only a slight spec bump. The biggest difference between the two was the price drop, from $1,200 down to $1,000. Now, you might be wondering, why compare the RTX 5070 Ti to the RTX 4080 Super? Shouldn't we be comparing the RTX 4080 or 4080 Super to the newer RTX 5080 instead? I'll explain why after we take a look at their side-by-side -side comparison. The RTX 5070 Ti features NVIDIA's GB203 Blackwell GPU with 8,960 CUDA cores and 16 gigabytes of GDDR7 memory. In comparison, the RTX 4080 Super uses the AD103 GPU with 10,240 CUDA cores and the same 16 gigabytes of memory, though it's equipped with slightly slower GDDR6X. The RTX 4080 Super launched at $1,000, while the RTX 5070 Ti debuted at $750. However, we know now that the actual retail prices for both GPUs have been higher than expected. I'll be comparing their performance at 1440p and 4K resolutions. After the side-by-side -side gameplay comparison, I'll explain why these two GPUs are being compared and which one offers better value in today's market. Here are the specs of the test system used. turn you into a beetle! Amicia, he's too powerful! We have to hide! <laughs> yes! I'll count to ten! Want to make it to the top? Start your ascent with the penthouse in Charger Hill. What 
doing? Go! Don't stop! Keep going! We can't leave her! Listen, good folk. Listen here. Would you ever trust a woman? Remember that. The Duchess summoned him. ましょう。
Was it you who did the deed? Away the beast shook a You've seen the results, and as you can tell, there's barely any difference between the two GPUs. Here's a 12-game average benchmark result from a different test run. At 2560 by 1440, the RTX 5070 Ti is just 4% faster than both the RTX 4080 Super and the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. At 4K resolution, the RTX 5070 Ti maintains a similar lead outperforming the RTX 4080 Super by about 4%. The overall result I got is somewhat different from Tech Power Up's GPU database. According to their benchmarks, the RTX 4080 Super is about 2% faster than the RTX 5070 Ti. In other words, these two GPUs are essentially neck and neck. So, why are we comparing these two GPUs again? Simple. Most retail stores are still selling the RTX 4080 and 4080 Super for at least $1,000. You should never pay more than $750 for either card. That's the launch price of the 5070 Ti. If you're considering a secondhand RTX 4080, 4080 Super, or even AMD's 7900 XTX, the price should be lower than the current retail price of the 5070 Ti, ideally no more than $700 to $750. Otherwise, it makes more sense to buy a brand new 5070 Ti card, which also offers newer features. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Hope this video helped you out. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. I'll be back soon with more GPU comparisons. Stay tuned!